So, which way do we go now? I don't know. Maybe flip a coin? Heads we go left, tails we go right. Tails it is, then. What is this place? It's so... well lit. I know, it's weird. And there isn't any sign of life anywhere in here. Do you think that kid would be in here? Only one way to find out. Come on. Great. More climbing. My favorite. Hey man, it's no picnic for me either. All that time to sit and relax while you risk life and limb climbing a harrowing object? I worry. Anyway, see you at the top. Wow, it's so cool up here. And look at me, I'm beast. I got mutant jumping abilities and never have to climb anything ever. Whew. I think I'm getting better at this climbing thing. This one was way, way taller, and I cried way less when I looked down this time. Yeah, and you got up here faster too. I barely even had enough time for my power nap. Wait, is that what you did while I was risking my life climbing this? You napped? Yeah, dude, sleep is important. You couldn't have, like, scouted ahead and made sure everything was safe when I got up here? What if there were snakes? Whatever, man. I'm too tired to argue with you right now. Let's just set up camp here for the night and, you know, head out in the morning after a good night's rest. Speak for yourself. I'm all rested up from my power nap. Cool. Then you can take first watch. Yeah, okay, I guess. You did just have to climb that whole thing like some kind of nerd without mutant abilities. I guess the least I can do is take first watch. Night, Chief. Night, Beast. Don't let the snakes get you. There aren't any damn snakes. That's exactly what the snakes want you to think. Beast, wake up! Quick! You're covered in snakes! Huh? What? No! Not snakes! Get them off me! Get them off me! Dude, there aren't any snakes. Why would you say there are snakes when there are no snakes? You know I don't like snakes. Why would you lie? That's so mean. Oh yeah? All those jokes about you banging my mom and a little snake joke is over the line for you? Yeah. You don't joke about snakes. Ever. Okay. Okay. Fine. I didn't know you felt so strongly about this. Well, now you do. Don't let it happen again. My bad, man. Well, it seems like you're up now. So we better get a move on. That hobbit isn't going to find himself. You don't know that. He might find himself. He might be at the shelf right now, drinking 20% off Jaeger bombs, and we're out here like a couple of chumps. He definitely didn't find his way home. Yeah, I know. Those hobbits are real dumb. They couldn't find their way out of a paper bag. I just really want to go home. Well, the quicker we find him, the quicker we can get back. Come on, man. You'll be ankle deep in Jaeger bombs before you know it. Yeah, all right. Ankle deep isn't that high, you know. What? You said that I would be ankle deep in Jaeger bombs, and like, ankle deep isn't a very impressive image. Dude, ankle deep is so much Jaeger. Like, if you were in a swimming pool, ankle deep in Jaeger would be so much in a swimming pool. I mean, I guess if this were a literal situation, that would be true. But this is an imaginary scenario. Why not paint a more compelling image? Like, if I'm already in a swimming pool, why not just fill the whole pool with Jaeger? That would be way too much, though. It'd be such a waste. You're not paying for the imaginary Jaeger. Well, maybe not me, but someone is. Probably whoever owns the imaginary pool. They already aren't going to be stoked that I drained their pool and filled it with Jaeger. Just imagine how pissed they would be if I filled the whole damn thing. On their dime, no less. I don't think you're grasping the concept of imaginary, dude. And another thing. Who's cleaning up after this Jaeger pool party? Is there an imaginary maid? She is going to be none too pleased about this entire deb- ah! What the hell is that? I don't know what that is, but I don't like it. Well, mission over. Guess we better head back and tell the Batman that the Hobbit is dead. Sorry for their loss. Dude, no. We can't stop until we find him. Even if it is just his tiny, tiny corpse. Uh, fine. You're right. Okay, now it's your turn. Just use your mutant abilities to jump over. Pretty easy. I don't have mutant abilities, asshole. Oh, right. I guess you'll just have to balance along the edge and come across that way. 
Man, that sounds terrifying. Good luck. Don't die. Watch out for snakes. There aren't any snakes. That's what you said last time. There aren't any snakes this time. The ah! Crap, 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 crap. Help, beast. Help me. It's pulling me under. Shit, 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 shit. Gotta help him. Gotta help him. Ah, a snake. Please, Mr. Snake. I beg you not to kill me. My friend is in trouble and I really need to help him. I can't do that if you kill me, so please, please don't kill me. Hurry, man. I got you, buddy. All right, Mr. Snake, do your thing. Holy crap, thank you so much. If it hadn't been for you, I'd have been a goner for sure. Don't thank me. Thank my new friend, Mr. Snake. Mr. Snake? Mr. Snake! I thank him for his sacrifice. It will not be in vain. Thanks, man. He died doing what he loved. Being a snake. No time to mourn the fallen, friend. We need to see if that hobbit is here. I don't see him. Should we, like, I don't know, call his name and see if he comes? Hobbit. Here, hobbit, hobbit. You can't call him like that. He has a name. It's Pippin. Here, Pippin. Come here, boy. Who wants a treat? Is it you? Do you want a treat? Well, now he's going to be expecting a treat when he gets here. Nice going, idiot. I don't think he's here. Yeah, you're probably right. Man, what a waste of time and also almost my life. Oh, I know, right? Can you imagine if you had died and the Hobbit wasn't even here? How anticlimactic. Somehow, I don't think that narrative consistency would be my biggest concern in that scenario. Yeah, you're probably right. Any idea how we should get down from here? I mean, probably climb. Wait, are you telling me that in addition to not having mutant jumping abilities, you also don't have mutant falling abilities? <sighs> so it would seem. Dude, that sucks. You are so useless. Why are you even here? I'm starting to ask myself the very same question. At least you have a nice long climb to contemplate your terrible life choices. I'll be napping at the bottom. Later, loser. You're so useless. Why are you even here? Whatever, dude. I know I'm an excellent climber. <laughs>